What's going on guys? This is STG. I got a bit of a special unboxing today guys. So during the drop on my site they that I usually buy coins from, they had tons of gold coins. Now I got it before there was a huge drop, but it was still, I think gold was around 16... I want to say 1680 an ounce and you know as of lately it's gone up and but it was down to about you know I think it was 1630 ish and so basically I picked up these coins and maybe like a day later they basically sold out of almost every gold coin except like a one ounce coins so I was very fortunate to get these. I got the Mexican two and a half pesos, the five pesos, the 10 pesos, and the 20 pesos. <coughs> Excuse me. So guys, I don't know if there's gonna be a restrike in these coins. So for the two and a half pesos, um, the restrike, I'm trying to think, I believe it was in 19, either, uh, I think it was 1955, if I'm not mistaken. The five was 19, also 55. The 10 was 1959 and the 20 was 1959. I hope that's right. I'm going to, tr I'm trying to go from memory here, guys. So, without further ado, guys, I'm going to see if they are restrikes. I have a feeling they might be, although for the 20 pesos in the past, I have gotten a non-restrike coin from them. But usually all the other denominations that I've purchased from them have been restrikes. I don't know if someone had a collection that they were selling. And... Uh, We'll see what I got. Oh, look at this. They put a box in a box. <laughs> Probably in a box. Which is kind of odd. They normally don't. They normally just put it in one box. And they put it in this little pouch here. I guess you could call it. And uh, I'm surprised there's no invoice. So usually they, maybe it's in here. But okay. I'm gonna try to feel don't want to try to cut through any coin or anything here. Okay, and we have the invoice. I'm just going to take that out, guys. I just don't want to show any personal information here. And wow. Woo! Let's see what we got. So, guys, check it out. I got my gold coins. I haven't, I haven't seen what years they are yet. So let's start with the Dulce Medios. This is 15.5 millimeters in diameter. And look at that. That is beautiful. Beautiful, guys. Look at that. All right. Let's see if it's a restrike. And it is... I can't even see. 1945. So... I'm trying to think if that's a... I don't think that's a restrike year, right? I'm not sure, guys. I'm going to pause it for a minute, and I'm just going to check real quick. Welcome back, guys. So, yes, this is not a restrike, guys. I am happy. That is awesome. I basically just adjusted my camera here a little bit, and I turned on the light. We got a little bit better view. Check it out, guys. Look at that. So again, 15.5 millimeters in diameter, and here we go. There's the gold weight, 90% gold, guys. Check it out. Look at that. Looks like pretty BU condition to me. All right, guys, that was the Dulce Medio, or two and a half. Let's go with the five peso, guys. Looks like it got a little copper spot there. So check it out, let's see, and, okay, this is 1955, so this one is a restrike, I know that, that is beautiful. This one, I'm trying to think of the diameter, uh, 
Um, I don't know. I think it's somewhere like 19 and a half. Let me just pause it again real quick. <laughs> it's okay, guys. I guess you don't really care about that, but it's just a beautiful coin, guys. So this is a restrike, and I believe I have this restrike already, too. So this one I might sell, but definitely this two and a half Dosi Medios. I'm definitely going to be keeping this and adding it to my stack. Still beautiful coin. Glad I got that. And that was the five pesos, cinco pesos. And here we go, guys. The ten pesos. Let's see if it's a restrike. And... It is a restrike. 1959 was the restrike year. This one I think is 22 and a half millimeters. You see the gold weight, it's almost a fourth of an ounce of gold there. And it is just beautiful. Kind of looks like they purchased these, I don't know, in a lot or something. I don't, it's kind of strange. Um, but here, you know, you could see the gold content and what they are. So yeah, this is definitely also a restrike. DS pesos, 10 pesos. But again, I just love that design of the eagle and the snake in its mouth sitting on a cactus. It is just a beautiful design, guys. <laughs> Finally, last... And certainly not least, wow, 1919, guys. Check it out. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I am so happy. Wow. Guys, so they started making these in 1917, I believe. And the restrike is from 1959. So, guys, check it out. I got a non-restrike, 1919. I know it's not, it probably is in AU condition, as you could see here, guys. Oh my God, I'm so happy. So the first time this, this site sent me this coin, it was a um, 1918. And now I got the 1919, guys. So this is definitely going in my collection, guys. This is the Venti Pesos, and as you can see here, it has the beautiful Aztec slash Mayan calendar. I should take these out and show you guys, and, and when I put them in the capsules, to see how beautiful these coins really are. I am so happy, guys. Oh my god. This is probably, I'd say, hmm... I don't know if it's a 58, maybe it would be an AU55, but wow, I am so happy that this is a non-restrike, guys. These non-restrikes are worth uh, significantly more, so I am ecstatic that I was able to get this for such a... Actually, this was the cheapest I ever paid for this coin, so I was, I'm so happy that I got a non-restrike year. So guys, I'm just going to put them in capsules, and then I'll show you guys, and uh, we'll take it from there. Hey guys, welcome back. As you can see, I put them in the capsules. Just a slight correction on this coin. The 1945 was actually a restrike year. So I'm thinking this might be an older restrike. I actually have this coin and it has a more orangey color to it. I'm thinking that's probably a newer restrike since the more yellowish gold color appears to be older restrikes for the other coins as well. Again, this coin was produced from 1908 until 1948. It is 15 and a half millimeters in diameter and it is 90% um, gold, guys. So it's just a beautiful little coin. Next up, we have the 1955 Cinco Pesos. Again, this is also a restrike year. This coin was produced from 1905 until 1955. It is 19 millimeters in diameter, 
90% gold and they pretty much all have the same design of the snake in the eagle's mouth sitting on a cactus which is a beautiful beautiful design next up we have the DS pesos 1959 this is 22 and a half millimeters this one they made from I believe it was 1905 until 1959 and Again, it has Mr. Hidalgo on it. He is a famous person in Mexican history. And again, it has the snake in the eagle's mouth, guys. Just a beautiful, beautiful design. Last and not least, we have the 20 pesos from 1919. Again, this was made from 1917 until 1959, which was the restrike year. And it is just an amazing coin, guys. This is my favorite gold coin of all time with the beautiful Aztec slash Mayan calendar. As you can see, guys, this still has some luster left in the fields. And I don't know if I were to grade this, I might give it around a 53 or 55. It is just a beautiful coin, guys. And just to think about 100 years ago, this coin was in circulation. It just blows my mind, guys. This is 27 and a half millimeters. This is approximately, I believe, 0.48 uh, ounces of gold. And I just love it, guys. All right, guys. Thank you so much for watching my video of my Mexican gold unboxing. Please comment, like, subscribe, and as always, stack that gold.